Hello everyone, what is up guys? It is Gladiator from Gladiator Gaming and in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to build the mini bike and more specifically how to get the parts as well as how to actually build it like get the schematic to build it or the book well it's like a magazine but it's still the schematic technically but um, first things first you want to get the book mini bikes for dumb shits now the best way to get this I would say what did I just get hurt from what the fuck um, yeah but the best way to get the book is from supply drops and every I have mine set to every 24 hours which it is default so every 24 hours basically one day um, there will be a supply drop landing and when it lands you want to go ahead and right before it lands try to track the location when you find it I would just hit our our uh, it is triangle or Y on Xbox one and just hit quick quick waypoint over it so when it lands and disappears on your map you'll still be able to track it and get to the actual location so that's what I would use for actually um, tracking it so you don't lose location of it most time you will find it pretty early I found mine on like day like six so that is basically um, pretty easy to do it's not really the hardest part of making a mini bike okay so when you do it you have to have a forge um, a forge is pretty easy to make you just gotta kinda get lucky and get short iron pipes which can be gotten through um, wrench wrenches like if you have a wrench or if you find one you can actually go and uh, destroy toilets with it and you'll actually get it that way or if you just destroy toilets together toilets um, I'm trying to think what else cars can have them in there but um, definitely toilets just destroy it I don't think you need the wrench um, but I just think you get more if you have the wrench. Let me go ahead and take care of her. Come here. Oh, there's a couple. Oh. It's weird. Is this like a horde attacking me at like five? Damn it, I missed the headshot. This is kind of weird though. Like, I didn't expect to get attacked like at five. But, um, I have my hunting rifle, and oh, I want to show you guys my hunting rifle real quick. It has really good parts on it, I think. See, so had the purple, um, barrel, and then orange, so it's pretty good. I had to use, uh, crappier parts just to finish it, but, um, yeah, guys, I think it's pretty good. Let me just go ahead and take care of these before, sorry for the interruption, guys, but, um, uh, she I'll just let her die in the spikes okay so back to what I was saying um, yeah so once you craft your forge you'll go ahead and see the mini bike chassis in here right here you craft it this is like the frame you see you put it on the ground then you can start assembling it which I will show you what it would look like so as you see you just start adding parts onto it this is what it looks like um, at first with nothing on it just looks like the chassis right here but um, I'm gonna go ahead and add the stuff back okay so once you actually do that you can start uh, finding parts for it oh crap I walked into the fire let me go ahead and drink something real quick because um, I'm on fire you know I'm just too hot call the police and the firemen okay I'm gonna stop there <laughs> but um, after you do that you can go ahead and set out in the world and start finding parts now another big thing you want to find the wrench you either the best thing that you could do, oh crap, I missed, is actually find the blueprint um, for the wrench. And again, that's from supply drops, getting lucky, getting it in bookcases, wherever. Just try to find the blueprint. That's why it is like a certain uh, time that you guys might not be able to make it. This isn't just like a follow the steps. You got to kind of get lucky with a lot of what you're doing. But if you find a wrench, you won't have enough durability in that one wrench to actually um, get all the parts you'll need from the cars because it is pretty random. So um, once you do that and you get your wrench, you can go ahead and start hitting cars with it and actually collecting your parts. Now the parts you can actually get by hitting cars, I will show you, are handle... No, you don't get the handlebars. You get the mini bike wheels. Or, yeah, you can get wheels from it, but I'll explain that in a second. You get the battery and small engine. Now everything else, I don't believe you can get from cars, but these two right here, 
uh, impact your speed, especially the engine. So if you want your mini bike to be fast, have a good small engine. Now wheels can be gotten uh, by uh, just finding random wheels. Like there'll be one tire on the ground, let's say. And um, God, you know what? You want some? Jesus, why do they always attack me while I make videos? Okay. Um, but you'll see like a one tire on the ground, maybe by a mechanic shop. I'm in a random generated world right now. So, um, I got lucky enough to spawn by a place with the actual like mechanic shop. But, um, yeah, you'll see it on the ground. You just hit it with your wrench, destroy it. And then you might, if you're lucky enough, get some wheels added in right now. I have pretty crappy wheels compared to how I did on my other world. So, um, I'll be looking for some more wheels for that. But um, as far as those three uh, parts go, um, mini bike seat and handlebars can be crafted from your crafting menu in here. You go down to resources and you'll actually find mini bike handlebars. And it needs handlebars, duct tape, scrap cable, headlight, short iron pipe. Headlights can be gotten from um, cars as well. So don't you don't have to worry about that. Handlebars are pretty easy to make as well. Nothing really too hard right there. And then you got your mini bike seat. Mini bike seat is pretty easy to craft as well. Um, leather obviously gotten from um, cars. You can get leather from cars as well. I don't know if you knew that. Um, as well as if you go to your skills, which I will show you right here. Um, where would it be? I think in resources. It's one of these scavenging resources. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Oh, it's right here. Yeah, it's in. It's actually in clothing. And it's called leather tanning. It lets you convert animal hide to leather. So if you want to go ahead and do that and don't have to worry about finding the leather, then go ahead and do that. But um, another big thing is scrap cable. Now, if you're in a navs gain world, you can find scrap cable from ovens, refrigerators, stuff like that. Just getting it with a wrench. But if you're in a random generator world, I'll go ahead and walk out and show you guys how to actually get scrap cable from that. You can get it from ovens as well. Now, you can get uh, scrap cable from inside a car just searching them, but it's really, 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 really rare for someone to get uh, scrap cable from inside a car just searching them. But uh, there is upside. If you can go ahead on, on your world, find the destroyed place, you see with these like destroyed buildings, they'll have ovens in them most of the time. And that's how you can actually go ahead and get it. So first one I walk up to right here has an oven in it. You go ahead and you start hitting this with the wrench, you're definitely going to get one scrap cable to two. Maybe even more if you're lucky enough. So there's a scrap cable for that. So go ahead and try to find a place that, or even find a building. And if the building has a ref refrigerator or an oven, then go ahead and get your scrap cable that way. It took me a while to figure out that <laughs> those places actually have stuff in them. But um, there's that. Okay, so I explained pretty much all the parts you'll need. Now, um, another thing I want to go ahead and talk about is gas. Gas is pretty easy to find. Obviously, you can get it from cars as well. You don't get a lot from cars, but um, hitting cars with the wrench, you can get gas. Um, as well as finding a gas uh, can blueprint, you can start crafting gas, which is pretty nice. And uh, another big thing that I want to go ahead and reiterate is actually finding a mechanics place, like a car dealership, something like that. They'll have gas pumps there. Uh, that's how you're going to be able to get it. Now, what I actually want to do, I want to show off like the mini bike right here. And uh, first things first, I forget yet to fuel it up. So let's go ahead and fuel this bad boy up. I got some gas cans in here. We're going to go ahead and right here, you could fill it up this way, but it only gives 250 at a time. Or you just go ahead and go to the actual like inside of it. You could add the gas that way. So we're going to go ahead and drive this. Um, Oh yeah, that's another thing I want to talk about. Don't build it inside of a place where like it's really hard to get out of. Try to build it out in the open. Um, I knew I could get mine out, but some people can. And wow, this is pretty fast. This is like one of the first times that I've actually rode it. Because I just recently have built this to show you guys in the video. But um, I'm going to go ahead and drive to the city. And I'm actually going to show you guys where I found gas and uh, the tires as well. So we'll just go ahead and go past this place. And I believe it's over here. Um, so I was lucky enough in the random generator world to actually spawn by a place like this. Like a gas station. 
So um, here's the barrels. You get one of these, and if you have the gla gas pr <laughs> glass print, gas print, uh, blueprint, um, gas print, gas gas thingy blueprint, whatever. Sorry, I'm getting tongue tied. Um, you can go ahead and take this and craft it to like a thousand gas. And right here, you can actually loot these. I have my loot set on reset every five days in the modded options. So um, I'll come back here in about three days because I just looted this. Uh, about two days ago and there'll be more gas waiting for me as well as all the gas I got from the cars like there's a lot and obviously this is another good place crack a book if you go in here um, you can actually loot some bookshelves and most times they'll have some blueprints so you might be able to find the wrench blueprint in that but honestly your best bet for finding it is gonna be from some random zombies but the best 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 way to actually find the wrench blueprint is definitely from supply drops because I don't know why but I feel like it's just me or is it just supply drops any like blueprint I need I'll just go up to a random supply drop they'll have it for me I don't know why but oh look here's a supply drop in the actual video so with the remaining time I'm gonna go ahead and chase it I'm gonna go ahead and use my method that I'm telling you guys how to actually do this uh, me and my cousin came up with it mostly him but uh you just go ahead and put your quick waypoint over it so when it falls you actually know where it's at so we'll go ahead and chase it and wow this this mini bike runs really great don't expect your mini bike to run this good it might run better but um it just depends on your small engine and i think your battery so um yeah keep that on guys okay so my voice might get drowned out a little bit from this um thunder but it's all good oh yeah another thing you can actually hit like pigs and deer with your uh, <laughs> mini bike and kill them in like one shot it's pretty funny so if you don't have any like ammo to hunt or bow like arrows or anything you can go ahead and just run them over but yeah guys you want to go ahead and try to build a mini bike as fast as you can because look at how like fast i'm traveling it's super super convenient like really convenient oh I went past it that's how fast I was going okay we'll go ahead and circle back in here we'll go ahead and see what's in here open okay so <laughs> I actually needed this <laughs> this is what I'm talking about I actually needed this and it gives it to me what is this exploding crossbow bolt I don't know I think I already had it I guess not so um, now I can just build snipers I have a lot of good sniper parts to add but um, I'm kind of going off uh, topic here but I want to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching and if you have any like comments on like mini bikes and stuff that I didn't cover in this because I'm just going off the top of my head go ahead and put it in the comments below and I'll try to answer them to the best of my knowledge uh, but yeah guys it's been gladiator from gladiator gaming and thank you for the recent support of my videos I love you all peace out